there is a function called audio info, which will allow us as part of a computer program to read in some basic information about an audio file. This is separate and different from when we want to read in the signal of samples contained in an audio file. Here, we're more interested in figuring out just some basic information, like whether the signal in the audio file is a mono signal or a stereo signal, or whether this signal is an uncompressed data file, or whether there's some kind of data compression that was used to create the file. We can also figure out how long the signal is. We can figure this out for a time in seconds, or also a total number of samples. Let's take a closer look at using the audio info function. Here's an example of how to use the audio info function. The idea is to have a method that allows us as the programmer to go out and fetch important information about a sound file without having to actually read in the entire signal into MATLAB first. The syntax for using this function is pretty basic. You're just going to use audio info and then as an input variable, we need to put in the file name. This is going to be a text string, so we'll use single quotations, and I'm going to look up the info for newfile.wave. Close off the parentheses. Here, I'm going to leave off the semicolon so I can see the output of using this function. Here, we're going to create a new special kind of variable. This is called a structure. We'll explore this type of variable more in videos in the future. For now, I'm going to give it a name called signal info, but you can name it whatever you'd like. Now when I execute this command, I can see the output and what all gets created by using this function. Here, I'm going to get several pieces of information about my file. Things like the file name, where it exists on my computer's hard drive, the compression method, whether it was an uncompressed file like a WAV file, whether it was compressed like MP3, the number of channels, meaning whether it's mono like this file, the number of channels was two, that would be a stereo file. Got the sampling rate, the total number of samples, which is information about the length of the file, the duration, here's the time in seconds, then any metadata that's stored with the file, like the title, comments, and artist, and then the bit depth of 16. Anytime I would just like to access one of the pieces of information from it, what I can do is use the structure, signal info, then use a period, and then Look up just one of the pieces of information. How about num channels? You can see that it will return for me just the value of one, meaning that it's a mono file. Also, I could do things like look up the bits per sample. Here, I'll show you a trick where if you use period, and start typing bits and use the tab button on your keyboard, it will auto complete and find this part of the structure that we're interested in working with tell me that there are 16 bits per sample. So this method or this function is very helpful for us. We're just trying to figure out basic information about our sound files.